Hey guys, before we get into the video, I just want to say happy Thanksgiving for all you guys. I'm uploading this a day late afterwards. You guys have enjoyed already your Thanksgivings. So shout out to everybody. And I hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving. For everyone who wants to purchase a decal to support the channel, make sure to leave your phone number. I'm going to be giving every single person a call that purchases a decal to support the channel. So if you guys want to purchase a decal, check it out down below and make sure not to forget to leave your phone number. I'll be calling every single one of you guys, but without further ado, let's jump right back into the video. All right, guys, I'm in my room. Crazy stuff here. We got some fuel injectors, fuel injector pullers, some exhaust tips, boys. Quattis, what else do you want? Hey, guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. And today, we're using the G7X Mark III. So welcome back to some good ass quality. And uh, got my boy Johnny over here. You got a haircut at uh, Sears. Check it out, check it out. Check out the Ooh, fresh cut. The fresh cut, Ooh, Oh, boy. All right, shout out to Sears. So we got some tips right here. It's for the 128. We got quad tips. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and see if this will work. I actually expect, from the pictures, I thought it'd be shorter. So it looks like we might have to drill a hole right here and it's gonna be, it's gonna have to be routed like that. The reason I say that is because the battery compartment on the 128s and the 328s is like right here. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to use this. So uh, we'll go take it to the shop, we'll see how it looks. Maybe they'll test fit it for us. Hopefully they are open, cause tomorrow's Thanksgiving. Yeah, so hopefully. Hopefully. Man. Oh, these lights are so toxic. They're not LEDs. All right, hopefully it works. Huh? Hopefully they're open. Also, we got the fridge. So shout out to Newware. Um, this isn't actually their sponsored video. Again, they told me to sponsor it a month after using it. They told me to give me. They told me to give you guys my honest review after using this thing for a month. So I'm just gonna go ahead, take it to the shop, unbox it, have fun with it. Um, that Keys Motorsports. What is it? Bumpers, right? Bumpers, front oh and God. rear. So we got brand new bumpers. Let's go ahead. M Sport and everything, dude. This is gonna be sick. <laughs> it's huge, bro. Anyways, let's go ahead and load this up. Jonathan actually brought his van. Yeah. Super convenient. Let's go ahead and get to it. Dang, guys, it is actually freezing. Your boy's gonna have to get a jacket. Don't wanna get sick. It's no longer the summer anymore. I can't just be wearing t shirts and stuff. So let's go ahead and get a jacket real quick because your boy doesn't wanna get sick and not be able to bring you guys the best content possible. Jacket, let's go, let's go. By the way, the, the whole. I'm probably gonna have to get my haircut done by Sierra tomorrow. So we'll go ahead and do that as well. Honestly, it's possible. We got muscles. Let's just not drop it off. Yeah, we go to the gym now. Y'all, you know what I'm saying? So let's go ahead and set you guys up. Hope I don't drop my brand new camera. Oh dang, it's got a grip on the bottom. That's it actually? yeah, Dude. that's actually clean. You guys are sitting on a card of really Weird. Dude, why am I trusting? Uh, yeah, that's I the YouTuber know. life. Anyways, I'm gonna set you guys down. Do not move, please. You should. Let's hope. <laughs> Hey! Let's boys. go, boys! All right, so first off, let's go ahead, take the 128 down to the muffler shop. So, your boy actually thought about it. He brought the diffuser. So, I knew we were, we were gonna end up in a situation like this. Let's head down to the exhaust shop. I got the tips, I got the diffuser. Um, let's go ahead and get this muffler delete going. And your boy already has the fuzzy things. He's already ready for the wind. Your boy is ready to get back into, oh shit! <laughs> to get back into the game. By the way, guys, I don't know if you guys know, Jonathan sold his car. I'll explain that a little more in the video. And not so lucky with the gas. So, uh, might have to go get some gas. Dang, that sucks. No more eyes on the prize. We gotta go get this muffled delete done. Let's go. And then after this muffled delete, we're probably gonna go ahead and uh, get some gas because we need that ASAP. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. All right, guys, a lot of the doors are closed. I really hope that they are uh, open. The muffler portion is open, though. You never know. All right, guys, so I just spoke with the owners. Uh, Thanksgiving is tomorrow, so uh, they close at 2 today, so they won't be able to get it done. And it's not a normal uh, muffler delete. They said they could do it for 250 bucks. So if any of you guys are getting quotes over 250 bucks to turn a, like a, uh, an N52 into a quad tip or a dual tip, just know you're paying way over. I paid 600 I paid 700 for my 330i. Yeah, that was a ripoff. <laughs> but then I, I found a place that charged me hourly. So make sure you guys find a place like this where they charge you for the job. It was 250 Um, It's a lot of money still, but uh, it's completely doable. And I can imagine already with the quad tips and the muffler delete. It's gonna sound so good. Definitely well worth it. I got the tips myself because I know tips are like super expensive. I think I paid like $200 for tips on the M3 from here. So I bought my own tips for 50 bucks off eBay and they're gonna modify them to make them work. Anyways, we're gonna get something to eat. Yeah. And then we're gonna hopefully try to find another muffin delete place. If not, uh, we'll come back here in a week, unfortunately. So uh, don't worry, the video doesn't end here. <laughs> we'll, we'll get you guys some good content. I'm skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. I just wanna feel alive. 
And we're back at Burger King, boys. Long time, no see. I think it's been like four months. Psych! We gun our asses down to Subway. We gotta keep it healthy, boys. No more Burger King. None of that baloney schmoney. I really hope my bumper doesn't. That hurts. All right, park right up front, right in front of my my new favorite place. I think I'm breaking. FYI guys, download the Subway Rewards app. This is what I've been using. It's actually pretty good, not gonna lie. Get your boy already saving money. Alright guys, we just got something to eat. I know I'm full. I'm full. Yeah. So let's go ahead and check out another mofo place right around the block and then we'll check it out, see if they're cool with it. If not, we're gonna have to wait till next week, unfortunately. But let's just hope they're open and they'll do the job for us. Mistakes. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes Try not to hold me down, feel alive when I'm in this town Look at the beautiful stars Damn! Alright, well, um, we'll try one more in North Highland. Uh, wish us luck. I don't have content, there's a cop right there. Try to hold the camera, I'm gonna gun it, I'm gonna gun it. You oh ready? my god. Why is he driving off? Wait, you gotta, you gotta drive faster past him. This thing is slow, man. You couldn't get a ticket what if you wanted to. What are you talking about? <laughs> You're not even in sport. Huh? You're not even in sport. <laughs> I mean, it's the same thing. It's the same, same guy. Same thing. It doesn't make a difference. Like, don't, don't you feel like a savage if you pass a cop going even a mile an hour faster? Yeah. You just feel like a savage. But then when that cop feels like actually owning you. <laughs> I know. Because he could technically pull us over for that. We're just harbor freight real quick, just getting a few things. So me and Jonathan are looking for some clips for his board because he took some of mine. Guys, these are sick. These ones actually go into your normal drill. You can use, just use these guys, which is really nice. You don't have to use these ones. So you don't have to have two different guns. You can just use your OEM one. So honest to God, you know what? Your boy might have to snipe it. You know what? I need to control myself. I'm not going to do an impulse buy real quick. I'll wait till they have a better deal. 15% is nothing. Sometimes they have like a 30%. Yeah. I'll wait for that. I'll wait for that. All right, we got our stuff. Let's head out. All right, is this what I think? Okay, so guys, we can't do a muffle delete, but I think this is the next best thing. 20 bucks? 20 bucks? Let's, let's, get our, let's turn our asses around. Where's that Yui? This thing's almost too cheap. Should I trust it though? Yeah, what could go wrong? It's so dirty, yo. We're gonna have to scrape all that up. But hey, we at the shop, boys. <laughs> I got that for you. <laughs> this dude's crazy. I got that. Oh, what is this guy? <laughs> Before we actually start working on this bad boy, let's go ahead and show you guys the fridge that we got. Dang, that packaging though. So guys, this is actually an outdoor fridge, so we might as well enjoy it in the partially outdoor garage area. So let's go ahead and install this outside. Let's go ahead and take it out. Let's take it out. Anyways, guys, here is the fridge. Check that out, yo. Oh my lord. So we're gonna have to go ahead and also uh, put on the, there's a handle that goes here, which is really nice. So we'll go ahead and do the dual handle, but check that out. It smells like a new fridge. It fits 90, I think 90 cans. That's what it advertises for, so. Guys, so this is pretty neat. So we're going ahead and we're actually putting it together. You can actually use these regular legs to balance it, or you can go ahead and use these wheel ones, which are pretty sick. So, all right guys, I'm gonna keep those wheels uh, for future reference, because they're actually pretty nice. But we just thought about it. We don't want this thing moving everywhere. We want it kind of in a fixed spot anyways. So we're gonna go ahead and use the original legs that it came with. Uh, we just brought it out ever so slightly. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Guys, look at the look at the LEDs blinking. <laughs> it has a heartbeat to it. I think Is you can it? also lock it too. Yeah, you can lock. Like, hold on, it's it's touch. Okay, it's set for forty guys. Let's go ahead and just fill up with some water. So the fridge is set up. Check this out. Check out this luxury. <laughs> what the hell? It even has a lock. So if I feel stingy, I can, <laughs> Dude, I can just lock it and take the keys with me. <laughs> that just looks so it looks sick. So cool. It's an it's an outdoor like stainless steel design. It looks really nice. Anyway, shout out to New Air for that. I'm gonna be giving them an also a 30 day review. That's what they wanted. So in like 30 days, I'll tell them you know if anything broke down on it, I'll let you guys know. I'm gonna give my honest opinion in 30 days. But if you guys want to check this fridge out right now, it'll be linked down below. Without further ado, this video is not a it's not a fridge review. So let's go ahead and get to work on the 128. We want to see how this thing sounds with a muffler dolly. I think it'd be kind of crazy. We'll be doing it ourselves. Isn't that pretty hype? Well, we won't be able to do piping, but we'll be able to yeah, cut it off. Yeah, at least just so. cut it off, and then we can at least hear the before and after, we so. We need some revs before and after. Yeah, we should do it real quick right now, actually. All right, uh, Jonathan, can you give us a few revs real quick, if you can do the honors? I can do the honors? Yes, sir. All right, so all this thing has right now is an intake from AFE, huh? Yep, there we go. The engine sounds good, but the exhaust is nothing. Nothing. So you guys heard it, absolutely nothing. Let's go ahead, chop off the muffler and see how, dude, I'm excited for this. I'm super hyped for this. And once we actually chop it off, you can also put on the diffuser, so. Yeah, so there's one support thing there. Uh, there's a connection that, like right here. I don't know what that is. I don't know, it's like an actual cable. And there's another bracket right here. So we're just gonna disconnect those real quick. And then uh, go ahead and cut the muffler. We can cut it right there. That is such a good spot to cut it. Like it's not close to the car whatsoever. So um, we can't mess up, there's no way. Probably unplug this thing first. Rip Arena. Hey, well, better safe than sorry. It's our first time doing it. That's true. Okay, so now the goal is to get it out of this hanger. All right, guys, so it's pretty much just chilling here now because I'm not going to love it. It's not that heavy. All right, guys, so I'm working at this bumper right now, right? And uh, it's actually a pain and I don't want to put it on and then I have to take it off in the body shop because I don't want the body shop to think it's too hard to take it off and then they paint it when this thing's on the car. So I'm actually going to leave it off. I'll let them paint the bumper and then uh, I'll put this on later or I'll tell them to put it on after they paint. Actually, I'll just tell them to put it on after they paint the bumper. Probably makes life a whole lot easier. Moment of true Johnny. You ready for this? <laughs> what, what if it doesn't sound like anything? Imagine. Yeah, that muffler is small. I feel like it doesn't do shit. Let's let's get it. I just saw a bunch of gas come out of there. <laughs> it pops. What? <laughs> that sounds good. We have to go for a drive. All right, guys, about to take it out for a spin. Let's just close the garage real quick. We'll be good to go. Let me give John a little. What is going on? This is like, <laughs> like Tokyo drift up in here. Guys, my miles per gallon, yeah, it's about 19.4. Average about 19.5 is like my, my highest and it's been there for a little bit. Let's see today after I cruise home if this actually go lower. Then you can actually prove if my muffler delete is worse in fuel economy or not. Anyways, go out for a test drive. This won't be like the M3, but it's gonna sound good. Yeah, you it's can hear the popping, pops. I hear it. Now we just need to cut off the cats. <laughs> nah, this is a, still a daily car. Yeah. Ooh. Yo, oh, dude, there's pops though. <laughs> that sounds good. That sounds so good. What, what the? That? that sounds way better than my T30i. I think it's because of the intake, dude. Yeah. Dude, that sounds so good. Not too shabby, not too shabby at all. It actually sounds really good. All right guys, I don't think that was too shabby. Look at the tail lights. Ooh, it's like a police. Anyways, um, all right guys, I am cruising right now and uh, there's literally no drone. Like if anything, I hear the engine just trying to 
you know, like uphill is trying to, you know, floor it a little bit. But other than that, I mean, no drone. Uh, fuel economy already went down to 18.3, but I was driving around the city pretty hard. So let's see by the time I get home if this gets any better. Also, forgive me, I need to work on the settings on this camera. I forgot I have to change the settings. So uh, if it comes out a little bit blurry right here, um, it's not the camera, it's just the settings. I'll fix it, don't worry. Guys, I'm really impressed. So I made it home on 19.4 not too shabby so yeah i consider that a, a, honestly like muffled deletes is not as bad in fuel climbing than i thought like now i'm getting 19.6 i don't know if you guys can see that but yeah getting 19.6 which is exactly what i was getting before so does a muffler delete you know mess up your gas your fuel economy no happy to say that perfectly fine you get to enjoy some good old sound at no cost other than the cost of installing it but you know you can just do what i did just cut it off but don't worry i'm adding tips don't worry anyways i'm on my way home without further ado remember guys i'm gonna be calling every single one of you guys that purchased the decal on thanksgiving so for everyone that watches today's video on thanksgiving shout out to you guys you guys are the real ones if you guys purchase a decal i'm gonna be calling every single person so make sure to leave your phone number not your email or i'll just email you if you give me your email um won't be as cool to be honest but yeah i would like to personally thank every single one of you guys who purchased the decal to support the channel i'm super excited to talk to some of you guys so yeah without further ado love y'all so much remember to stay humble see you guys in the next one peace out oh yeah and shout out to you guys 70k thank you guys yeah yeah let's go I ain't the first with the curse, with the thirst that I wanna be better, not worse, man, it hurts. I'm on this earth with my words and I put them all together in circles, I wanna have worth.